Hello YouTube and a happy new year. I thought I'd make a quick video update and uh, as I've made a video for a week or two about my uh, rating challenge, blitz rating challenge, which was to get a 2300 from zero and yeah it's not gone too well to be honest. Um, I think I realised a few things and that one of the problems with uh, when you get to a certain level of well when you're playing a certain level of player is that you just get found out really and my hacky play of hustling people on time controls and not thinking about the moves really and trying to berserk them and you know cheap endless cheapos I, I don't think is going to get me there so I realised I'm probably going to have to take a step backwards and I need to work on my tactics a bit more and probably positional chess probably everything really but um, yeah so we ended last year I've got a 2034 which is nowhere near excuse me 2300 blitz really um, what a few hi what are the highlights of I suppose um, yeah my average opponent is relatively high and I actually won more games than I lost which is always good I draw quite a few games I've noticed so need to convert a few of those a bit more um, <laughs> took down a couple of big guys but all in all some pretty shocking chess um, you know really I need to do better rapid yeah not great really I did get a 2100 there at some point. I don't know how I did that. But we're sort of, uh, yeah, and I had a few rapid games recently to blew those. Classical, we won't go there. Um, not going to have time for that. Bullet, yeah. I've got over 1 800. It's bizarre, really. I, I, I really struggle. I think you can't play Bullet with a 3D board, it's nearly impossible. But uh, ironically, I used to be 2300 in Bullet, and that's now my worst. The more I think about the game, the worse I'm getting at Bullet. Which is probably a good thing for improving your chest. So, what the conclusion is, is that I've been doing these... Um, not the studies on lie chest, but... Is it chest basics? No, it was... Oh, practice. Here we go. I thought we need to go back to basics here. Uh, I'm just missing too many. Um, it's getting to the end game is a weakness, definitely. And um, there's some really nice um, mating patterns um, that Lie Chess has got here. Um, where was the basic check mating patterns? Really, really nice. Um, simple uh, positions where you just have to find the right move obviously I mean it is just a puzzle but let's just go back to here I mean just literally starting with you know your basic mate and then working your way up to just being able to do this queen mate which may seem obviously things like mating with a rook but I mean I've lost games on time because I haven't managed to mate somebody in time in this position so it's all important things same with the queen and same with the, you know queen and bishop is a bit tricky actually you know uh, it sh shouldn't be tricky but it is but you get my point so I've realized that really need to go back and um, you know do some s just basic stuff really you know and um, before we try and go any further I think you know that's my you know that's my my instincts telling me so that brings me on to my next thing, which is where I, I studied a load of um, of the coaches on here. I had a look at their profiles and I looked at their things like their, well, typical, his training puzzle was only 1942, but um, a lot of these guys have got, um, you know, their training is pretty high relative to their their rating, you know, it's around a hundred points here or there, you know. And these are the guys that this is the level I'm, you know, they're they're, they're all hitting, 
this 2200 mark it seems roughly at least um, except the people that don't do it anyway I hope you get my point here I'm just trying to um, show you that um, there we go so, so you know um, so that's led me to go back to puzzles here and we got a 2113 which is pretty good so I've got this sort of goal where I'm going to say I'm going to get a 2200 in a puzzle setting and then I feel like I will be a bit more rounded so um, let's do some puzzles in this video a couple of puzzles and also we're going to play a few blitz games as well a couple of other things that have changed so I'm just going to play I think quickly Queen here which threatens mate there and attacks that bishop I failed it and what was wrong with that what is wrong with that move it threatens it threatens mate and it attacks his bishop yeah that's wrong that is interesting I'm confused about why that's wrong I just did that straight off the bat on instinct, which is, again, a classic example of why I need to work on these tactics. Um, by checking, we just takes, so that doesn't get me anywhere. Um, hmm. What is the right move here? Can anybody see? What is the right move? To me, that just felt so natural play queen b6 I'm struggling to find why that doesn't work to be honest he hasn't got a check um, he loses a piece that must be winning in a real game I suppose after he takes he, he would then no he hasn't got a check my rook's still there you can't see why that isn't winning let's think about this What's the most forcing move I've got here? Will probably be that rook check. Has to recapture with his queen. Without a doubt. Um, but that doesn't. Um, that doesn't actually uh, threaten anything, does it? Oh deary, deary me. What is the move here? You see this is this is the weakness. This is very I've realised there's certain tactical puzzles that you can be very good at and other tactical puzzles. Uh, you know, pu puzzles are solved in five seconds. in one second like I just did then. And uh, others that I'm just absolutely stumped on. And that's the weakness, that's the weakness, that's the pain you've got to go through to make yourself a better player I think see why why am I struggling to see the move on this puzzle I'm struggling there's lots of moves I want to play here but I can't see if I'm trying to find a forcing one but they don't look um, so black was a reasonably strong player they're 21-27 so obviously his, his uh, opponent was relatively strong as well I didn't see it so it, it must be something something. I want to mate him on the back here. I want to get his queen off here. I can't see a way to do it. I could play queen here, which is threatening mate there. We can just play... I don't see what that threatens when my queen comes here. It doesn't threaten anything. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I materially were the same. Um, I am struggling. I am struggling, and that's that's it. it's good to struggle because uh, if I play rook here. What's that doing? He takes my queen. Check. It's nothing. Uh, I'm just looking at anything here. Queen there, threatening his bishop. I'm just going to play my queen here because we get a move going. That's wrong as well. So this is getting pretty pretty drastic. I'm so amazed that this queen b6 doesn't work. Don't understand why. It cannot be check. There's nothing there. Nothing. Mm, can't be something horrific like queen down here. Surely to God. Wouldn't be that. 
going to... Definitely not that. I just had to play it to get out of my system. It's that. No way. No way. You have to be joking me. You have to be joking me. How is that? That's just so wrong. Let's take that. It's obvious. You can't take because of the mate. I'm not happy about that. I want to see why that's... Why is... Why is Queen B6 not winning then? Queen B3... I can't take... I can't do that because of the mate there. It's obvious now. I'm exchanged out. Okay. Got you. Fair enough. Um, so, the other thing is, there is a reason to why I'm doing this before playing some Blitz, is that I'm just finding, doing a few puzzles before playing, it's like warming up. I think it helps me play better. Um, better than playing one minute games, actually. I was just hacking out some one minute chests, and I felt I just started playing like an idiot. More of an idiot than usual. So, okay, so he's double, <laughs> double attack on this here. Um... Um, rook takes bishop. Rook takes bishop. Um, I instinctively I just want to take that bishop. And he takes my bishop. Uh, I can't really see what I'm. A pawn down. <sighs> Okay, if I go bishop c7, I'm hitting his bishop and threatening a back rank mate. So then we have uh, rook takes rook, rook takes rook. He's then got to play a move to sort out his um, back rank issues. Which would be what? Or we can just drop the bishop back here and then we have rook takes rook, rook takes rook and he's then got to lose a tempo to defend the back rank so it has to be that, yeah so I play here, I'm threatening back rank mate he has to um, I could just mate, I can't mate him here because he can drop it back so I have to and then okay so we actually got one right at last Right, so, yeah, that's quite a nice little puzzle, that. I nearly blundered again. I, w I wanted to play. Oh, I see, sorry, we're going too far here. Um, I can't remember what I did. Anyway, let's just get on with playing a game. So, the other thing is that's changed, I've decided, is that I've stopped playing three-minute flat chess, and I've stopped playing five-minute flat with no increment. And now I only play three minutes plus two increment. I've been inspired by the recent FIDE Blitz, World Blitz tri Championships 2017 and um, and basically I thought well I'm playing with this board like this uh, so I might as well and I want to go for some proper FIDE Blitz tournaments again so I might as well play the proper FIDE Blitz time control you know and actually I have to say it's quite nice having a couple of seconds increment to actually think about the game rather than just do any old stupid move. Yeah, so this person knows what they're doing here, and I'm putting a fool into a trap. It's a black mar d mar. Uh, not black mar d some some sort of hacky attack here, isn't it? But I, uh, what I tend to do is ignore it all. His knight's going to come in here now, and his bishop. Yeah, that's it. That's the way this works, isn't it? Um, now what's the move here? I think I... Can I just play that? And then it stops his knight and his bishop coming in. He can just take that with his bishop, actually. Oh, no, no he can't because the fork here. No, he can't just check. Yeah, that's, that's just a blunder, actually. That's a blunder by me. I think I just blundered. Never mind, it's a pawn for nothing. But yeah, I... In this gambit line, 
I quite like to take the pawn just for the sake of it. Um, let's get rid of that knight. Um, where is that knight going then? He probably can't believe his luck to have somebody as idiotic as me to play a move like that. I don't know what I was thinking then. Yeah, okay. So I, I don't actually, um, I don't really care. He's going to pin this here. I don't really care about that. I've got quite a nice development here. Um, can I hit his queen first? Probably not. Uh, he's going to get a, win another pawn there. Look. Let me take that. Castle queen side. Mega attack. All these pawns. How greedy is this person? Pretty greedy, I'd say. I'd probably take that pawn. Well, I think what we'll do is we'll just put that there. So it makes it a bit more difficult for him to uh, develop this bishop when it kind of time comes. He might play some horrific weakening move like uh, b3. So the problem now is is that 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, um, am I pawn down or two pawns down? Pawn down. But I have got a bit better development than him. I could take this, open up this file, probably be suicidal really. I can't see any practical benefit to that for me. We're struggling to find a good move here, really. Um, I really am. What can we do here? Prove the position. I think I'm just going to bring this knight in. Try and get rid of this knight, get a stronger centre here. And give up, just throw away a pawn for nothing. Reef. That's appalling. Absolutely appalling. Um, I'm, I'm not even. Yeah, this is a very strange sort of uh, situation where I, I seem unable to. Um, just gonna just try and hack into death. It's a ridiculous move. I'm just gonna put his bishop on that file. Maybe he'll put his knight back somewhere. Like that. Yeah, I thought he'd probably do that. Or maybe I'll get a cheap out of him. This is, I just deserve to lose um, wholeheartedly. He's got a nice check here. I'm not too worried now. I have to accept that I'm, I'm literally losing pawn after pawn now. And rightly so. In a in a long game, I should be crushed into oblivion. Okay. We'll just. Uh, <sighs> I mean, he should win this game. Check. Exchange queen. Oh, interesting. I'm surprised he wants to do that. I'm just trying to hack some pressure up here. There's nothing really special about this. I'm not even I haven't even got anything on time here. So is the only I can't really see anything. The only positive thing about this position is the uh so I've got a bit more development, I suppose. I really can't see much. I suppose now be the time as I need to rip open that. Try and swing some rook across here. Hmm. I don't know what's going on here. What have I missed here then? I really am playing badly. I didn't even see that. <coughs> I see, that's right, yeah. So that's... Hmm. I guess the only interesting thing is this pawn structure is pretty abysmal here. Um, maybe we'll play... 
stop this night getting into the game. Maybe it would been better just to go for these pawns. One, two, three, four, five. So I might be able to have more proper. Oh, misclicked. No! No, no, no! I, I just totally mis I, I missed just winning a piece then. Oh, dear. Dear, dear me. Oh. Not only did I click the rook to the wrong square, I, um. It's gonna bring it there. I probably should have just taken that pawn. <sighs> Deary me, come on. Come on, you c I can do better than this. I must be able to do better than this. I must. My only hope is to some ra horrific squindle. Yeah. On the, uh. I've got to just try and get on this pawn here. This is completely over. Really annoying that. That's my. I mean, to to play such a horrific, to not even look. I'm not even looking at his moves. I think that's the appallingness of this game is that I've somehow um, stopped. Uh, it's going to take me. Fake swindle here, but nothing really. Absolutely nothing. I've got him on time a little bit here. I mean, he must be. Uh, it's just shameful. I don't like winning a game like this, but hey, you got to do what he's threatening his pawn here. He's got his knight coming in here. Maybe I just need to um, accept the fact that. Uh, um, yeah, gonna do me there. I need some sort of desperado swindle, really. Check me, probably. I would. Just praying for some sort of a uh, cheapo. Check me then. Come on, you must be crazy here, man. So I'm just threatening, just trying to get a bit of time here. Yeah, that's a probably a reasonable move. Now I'm trying to get on this pawn. Mated. I'm gonna get mated there. Yeah. I mate. Um, he he should have mated me then. I can't believe it. He just got. He could have mated me. Couldn't he? Check. Yes. It must have been because the knight was covering. My bishop was in the way. Oh dear. How bad is that? Just check me. Oh dear. I am sorry. Playing such a disgusting game of chess, and probably I deserve to be mated. I cannot even think straight. I think we we'll just have to go here. Gonna check me, probably. I think that's gonna have to go. Now oh, he's threatening, mate. Oh, he was. Bring the pawn down. Correct. Oh, I'm getting mated. Yeah, I'm just getting mated. He had one second left. I, d I utterly and utterly, totally, totally deserved to lose that. But it was... I, I, is, I mean, I'm s I, I hope nobody's even watching this. I really do. What was this move back here? I mean, I'm a patser, but this guy's something else. I mean, this move here... Where I... I, I I've just... Th 
I do that and he plays that and I I mean I meant to play this I didn't even look at what he made the move that he made abysmal shocking shocking game of chess I ought to delete that really it's so bad um, beggar's belief but anyway let's try and find somebody oh dear right I'm going back to playing the new Maruno Patsa system which is sort of a London hybrid if he plays the King's Indian okay so this is just something really quite crazy what he's playing here, but it looks like junk. I'm a bit annoyed, really. It's a bit annoyed with um, that last game. I can play better than that, but oh, I just did something stupid then. Just threatening this. I'm just p desperate for him to take that night. It'd be wonderful if he did. Go on. Really awful game. Okay, he's gonna come and kick that in a minute, I suppose, isn't he? <sighs> there is nothing pretty about this next game. We're just gonna castle Queenside and just try and smash him to pieces. That is it. There is nothing else to it. No, uh. I'm gonna give up this pawn here. So I in the sort of hope that I'm going to get some um, I hope we'll bring that knight in you can't work people the same way with the, the, the increment oh dear that's, if I like that can't be right can it didn't even see that. I wasn't even I was not even looking at the board in any way again. But I'm not gonna give him his move. You can take that ball. I'll put my king there and bring that rook across. I've got to start cow I think I'm not I think this is quite interesting actually. I was talking about the blitz at the beginning. And now got this interesting situation where I, I've obviously decided to give up calculating anything and I'm just playing instinct and that's interesting because you just you just get a certain type of position don't you so now I'm I want that's not a threat I think I could take that and he can't with his queen but it will be a threat when I drop this back What's that threatening? Nothing really. Now I'm threatening. What? Well, well, you can just take that, obviously. But then, yeah. Okay. So <coughs> he can push his pawn at some point, but he can't at the moment. So I've got him on time a bit here. I think the interesting thing is, is that you get people on time, and you get quite a good position sometimes, and then you just sort of rush it. Takes takes. I need to get his bishop out of the way and play g4. Right. No, I don't actually want to work. <sighs> don't want to, definitely don't want to be exchanging queens. I'm just going to play that rook there. 
and then threaten to push that for me. It's weird, really, because I'm not sure. That's a bit annoying. Temporary issue, that's nothing to worry about. Now I could play. Hmm. Am I losing a piece there? If I play F3, I'm thinking too long. I'm thinking too long. That's costing me. <sighs> I could have just won a piece actually, just by check. I know it doesn't work. So, there's nothing on here at all. Absolutely nothing here. Yeah, he just protects it. So, again, I've to give away a lot of pawns for nothing. Hmm. We'll keep that for a minute. I don't really want to exchange my queen. It's the only good piece of. It's going to just put his queen there, really, and it's over. Change, running out of time. Two pawns down. A completely lost game, basically. Can't move my queen because of the threat of this check. Although it does let me come in here. Interesting check. Let's get rid of this. There's nothing there, is there? It's just a bluff. time here. Yeah, it's much harder to hustle people with this, this time control. You just can't do it. Again, great, this is great. Absolutely crushed, annihilated, running out of time. <sighs> Deary me. Another rook across. So it just, it's just all day long, isn't it? He's just having takes a form. Do you want any more pawns? <laughs> Do you want any more pawns? Go on, take that pawn. One, two, three, four, six. Have I ever played a game where my opponents had every pawn on the board? Quite funny. Oh God, can't you be more crazy than that? Go on. There you go. It's not difficult for you. To I can't even check him actually because of the. So I can go there. We really wouldn't care. Let me take it and get a queen. I would. What am I going to do? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. My point. I think I need to. My, my only hope is that he doesn't check me and then I just suicide off over the mine. Oh. Right. So I'm going to check in there. 
some sort of stalemate bluff here. Which is not going to happen. That'd be funny if it did. Oh, thank you. Oh, God. Bad. Very bad. Mm. Don't really know what to say about that. Just two terrible games of chess. You could say I, I have to credit my opponents for crushing me, obviously. That was fair enough. Um, let's go for English. I think we'll go for Inketo. Oh, we're going to crush me. Oh, crush me again. You're going to crush me. Oh, I might actually just play Knight F3. Really. He wants to play. Oh, do you know what? He's going to play f5 with that pawn structure then. I've just got to suck that up. So I'm just going to go. He is, you know, isn't he? He's going to play f5. He's not having it. He wants it. Should have dumped my knight in there, maybe. Um, he really wants this f5. He's angry, this chap, isn't he? Very angry. I might have to take that knight, actually. If he'll let me. Yeah. So, what's going on here? I'm just being crushed, I think, again. Attacking this pawn. Loss. I mean, I did get... Um, why is he going to let me take that pawn? There must be a reason for it. I'm just going to take it. Hmm. So he does get it back. But you have to because up his white square bishop. Whoa, big trouble. Got very strong control of these squares here. Let me just move that out of the way. Yeah, we'll get rid of that, that's fair enough, thank you. Not too sick with this pawn. Yep. So, what's going to happen here now then? I have some pressure on this pawn. I don't understand why the other two guys couldn't have played like this. It feels like I'm getting. I've actually got a hope vaguely. Hmm. I must be missing. I must be about to get made to or something. I can feel it. <sighs> this must be better for white. It has to be better for white. Check. Hmm. Let me just play that. Threatening this knight to win it. I don't want to give up my beautiful white square bishop, although he hasn't got a white square bishop. So I could push his pawn. He takes, takes, and then I lose pawns, and then obviously I just have to pin that. I think that's the best idea. I might get rid of his dark square bishop. Which would leave maybe his king a bit vulnerable. Let's just bring his rook out. So, what am I going to do here? I'm going to take that knight. Is there any sacrifices there? Exchange. I don't really think so. I'm going to lose his pawn. I think I'm just going to drop this back. Then I might just play this. Exchange pieces off. Um I think I'll play that first. I'm threatening to uh it's really a threat because he can drop his But 
it's, it's a sort of minor threat really. Feels like there should be something in here for me. There must be something here. If he moves this knight, it's got a big problem. Gets mated. Come on, got him on time. That is interesting. Um, what about that? That's not really a threat either, is it? Oh, come on. It has to be crushed beyond belief here. So just drop that back, double up on here, threaten to take that. Okay. Okay, so you can't you can't take that because it's pinned, obviously. Let me know what's coming next. Now it's. I think we're just liquidating to this one in game. It's completely one end game. lost position in every possible way. There's no you'd have to even somebody as bad as me c could win this game, believe it or not. Check me there. So I'm just gonna literally blast it into pieces down here. Uh check. Check. Ah, that's a bit annoying that I can't uh I can just go here. Can't I can't do that. Yeah, sorry. Just come in the back here. Okay. There we go. Okay. Yeah. It's pretty standard stuff, really. Should resign. And that was the end of that.